Hello everyone, how are you today? Well, today we're not starting with your books. Today we're going to start with these slides. In these slides, I have a new topic for you. This is the first conditional. When we talk about conditions, in Spanish we use the word sí. Sí para condiciones. In English, we use the word if. This is C, but just for conditions. We don't use yes. Okay, we can't use yes. So we use if. Now, when do we use conditionals? We use the first conditional, that this is the possible conditional, that we used to talk about possible future events and their results. What is the structure for the first conditional? We write if, and next to if, you write a sentence in simple present tense. Then you write a comma, and then you write a sentence in future using will. Or the other order, you use the sentence in future with will, and then you write if and the simple present tense. Both are the same, so you, just you are changing the order. Notice here, if with simple present, comma, and the sentence with will. Here, the sentence with will, and then if with simple present tense. The only one difference is that if you start your sentence using if, you need to write a comma. If you start your sentence using will, you don't write a comma. Notice? This is the difference. So we are going to uh, write sentences and the uses that we can uh, apply this first conditional. Remember, this is a possible conditional. This is for conditions, but this is possible. We talk about possible future events and possible results. 